Whether you've got extensive water damage or a small and sightly hole in need of a patch, knowing how to properly cut drywall is a big part of making a successful repair. Here's what you'll need. First, assess the scope of your repair to determine if it requires a new section of drywall or a simple drywall patch kit. For more extensive repairs like this one, you'll need to remove the damaged section of drywall then replace it with a new one. First, locate and mark the studs closest to the damage. Then, use a straight edge to outline the area you plan to cut out, making sure you expose or overlap a stud on either side of the damage. Next, outfit an oscillating multi-tool with a blade designed for cutting drywall. Turn it on and plunge cut into the wall. Move slowly along the outline, letting the blade do most of the work so your cut is clean and straight. Then, carefully remove the damaged section of the drywall. Next, measure the new wall opening carefully. Then, cut the new piece of drywall to size using the oscillating tool. Be sure to smooth any rough edges with a sanding block once your cuts are complete. Next, fasten the new section of drywall into the studs using the appropriate drywall screws. With the new drywall in place, you'll be ready to cover the seams with mesh tape and a layer of joint compound, just like the pros. If the wall damage is smaller than 7 inches in diameter, a drywall patch kit may be all you need and cutting will be minimal. These kits usually include a small container of joint compound, a spreader, and a durable patch, ideal for covering deep gouges or holes. To install a patch, first, clean up the area by cutting away any loose or ragged paper with a utility blade. Then sand it with a fine grit paper. Once the area is smooth, wipe it down with a cloth so it's dust-free. Then, place the self-adhesive patch across the hole, pressing it firmly into place. Finish up your repair by smoothing the area over with multiple coats of joint compound so that the patch's texture is no longer visible. After sanding the patch, prime and paint over your repair so that it seamlessly blends into the wall. Good luck and thanks for shopping at the Home Depot.